process more. Why can't you just make a deal with Why can't you just make a deal with the French? And people you are pick removed, someone up you and you take them straight back to France. That's entirely in the French interest as well. Well, what I'd say on returns agreements is that that is, of course, something that we continue to work um, towards. Um, you will know. You could do it that, tomorrow. Well, you, you, you could do it tomorrow. You, you will know, Mr. Holloway, that we offered, as part of our withdrawal from the European Union, a comprehensive um, returns arrangement, which the European Union decided not to adopt. Um, we clearly need to continue to discuss that with our European friends and neighbours. We obviously did previously have the Dublin Agreement, which did allow us to return several hundred people a year to EU member states, and presumably a lot of that was to France. Can you tell us how many um, asylum seekers or how many people arriving have been returned to any EU country in the course of the last uh, year or since January? Well, returns related to um, small boat arrivals um, the answer to that is um, 294 overall. 294 during the, in the last uh, this year in the answer, 2021. The answer in this year is five. Right. So in 2021, at a time when the um, uh, number of people arriving has gone up, the you've just been able to return five people. In the previous years, you've been. Uh, had several hundred people as part of a safe returns agreement. Do you have any agreement in place with the EU for those return agreements, for those returns? There is not a returns agreement with the European Union in, in place at the moment, as I was just explaining to um, oh, the Mr. number of, So the returns, since we lost the Dublin Agreement, the returns have got substantially worse then. So your predecessor to, to told us mind. this time last year that return agreements were our number one priority. It's strongly in the French national interest to agree such returns interest. That gives me significant cause for optimism. It would not be very difficult to improve on Dublin. Once we're outside of it, we'll be free to negotiate our own bilateral agreements, which I hope will be a significant improvement on Dublin. Instead, the opposite has happened. Is that correct? The ambition remains to secure successful returns arrangements with our European friends and neighbours.